you can use Zoom to create persistent meeting spaces, which can be very useful if you're going to be conducting any student group activities in which you want students to have the ability to meet with each other over the course of a few days, a few weeks, or even an entire semester. To create these persistent meeting spaces, start by going into your course and going into the Zoom interface. Then in the top right corner, click on schedule a new meeting. You will give your meeting a name that's appropriate for the meeting space. I'll call this one Group A Meeting Space. Next, you're going to want to make sure to go down to the recurring meeting option and turn it on. Then under recurrence, you're going to want to switch it to no fixed time. This is so the meeting space is open indefinitely and students can utilize it whenever they need to. Next, make sure that you turn off the waiting room. That way students can join without the host being there. Next, make sure that you turn on enable join before host. Again, this allows students to connect to this meeting space without the host actually being there. Finally, you can set alternative hosts by entering in students' email addresses here. The benefit of doing this is really that students would be able to record their meeting sessions if they want to. Once you're done, click on Save. If you go back to the Zoom interface of your course, you will see the new meeting space listed at the top. Once you have created these meeting spaces, students can access them the same way that they access their class sessions. But you'll want to make sure that students know which group they belong to so they know which meeting space to utilize.